Here at the University of West London, we want to help answer any questions you may have about degree apprenticeships. We've put together this guide to degree apprenticeships to help you make an informed decision about your future career. A degree apprenticeship is an opportunity to be employed by a business or company as an apprentice while completing a degree qualification at the same time. Typically, you'll have a minimum of six hours out of your 37 and a half hour working week set aside for studying at university or another degree awarding institution. A degree apprenticeship can take anywhere from three to six years to complete, but being employed at the same time will provide you with a salary and relevant work experience during this time. As a degree apprentice, you will be treated as an employee at your organisation, so you must be prepared to enter the world of work potentially well before your peers from school or college. You should always consider the pros and cons before deciding if this is the right choice for you. Pros include gaining work experience early, earning alongside your studies, in most cases gaining a full degree qualification and no student loan debt, but some cons like missing out on a typical student experience and having to balance studying and working could mean a degree apprenticeship is not for you. Finding a degree apprenticeship can be a bit harder than the normal application for a degree course. The easiest way to find an apprenticeship is through the National Apprenticeship Service. You can also check the apprenticeship section of the UCAS website or attend an apprenticeship, higher education or careers fair. The Government Apprenticeship Finder tool can also help narrow your search and you should also check the website of major employers near you in industries you're interested in or email them to ask directly. To apply for a degree apprenticeship, you will generally apply directly through an employer or the National Apprenticeship Service rather than through a university. The application is usually more like a job application than a university application. As employers run their own application processes, applying for each role will be slightly different, but most will require some of the same steps. First, you'll have to check that you're eligible to apply. Most degree apprenticeships have certain qualities and qualifications required of applicants, including having a certain standard in GCSE maths and English qualifications. Next, you should read the job description and person specification these contain information on what sort of applicant the employer is looking for and what responsibilities you should have in the position, if successful. The next step is to complete the application form and submit your CV and cover letter if required. If successful, you'll be invited to an interview, which may be part of a longer assessment day. Make sure you understand what type of interview you will be attending so you can really sell yourself and why you want the position. At UWL, we offer degree apprenticeships in many occupational areas, including computing and engineering, health and social care, and business and leadership. These degree apprenticeships can lead you to a range of different careers, such as a registered nurse, in the IT sector as a business manager, and more. To apply for an apprenticeship with UWL, you must apply directly through our employer partners. You can find a list of all current vacancies with UWL partners on our website. If you have any questions or want to know more about apprenticeships and the vacancies currently available, please don't hesitate to get in touch. Best of luck with your apprenticeship journey.